that's the best way as a parent to reach to out like to your child. You don't really have to be yeah. yeah. as mom. And, and that's not, and I don't think that's like the that. best way as a parent like, I'm not gonna to reach out to your child. You don't yeah, have mom, to. I'm, I'm not gonna work with mom on this. Yeah. I'm not gonna work with mom on this. I'm not gonna work with mom on this. I'm not gonna work with mom on this. not gonna work with mom on this. I'm not gonna work with mom on this. No, no, this shrunk in line. No, this is not inappropriate. I'm just saying. No, I don't think. I, I think it's this. Is, no, this shrunk in line. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> this shrunk in line. What is it? What is it? I don't know. My mic drops. Yeah. What is it? What is it called when somebody into oh, yeah, a concert? I, I don't believe as a mom that you have drops. to dress like yeah. your kids or behave like them. Yeah, I I don't believe as a mom that you have to dress like your kids or behave like them. The lighting might be off. I think your lipstick is too I think your blush is really good. I think your, I think your lipstick might be thrown yeah, out. Yeah, because it's too You might need a darker I think your lipstick is too If you put on a blush, is really good. I think your lipstick might be thrown out. because it's too You might need a darker lipstick. Don't rely on this camera. If you put on a red, it'll look really good. Or if you just have a gloss. Yeah, you look fine. Don't look at this. This is but don't rely like on this camera. Right. Like a, uh, yeah, yeah. But your blush looks really Yeah, nice. you look fine. Don't look at this. This is like no, I don't in think all the bright that my kids uh, yeah, would love, love it if I dress like that. But your blush looks really nice. I think I think so. Yeah. Yeah. But uh, no, I, I don't think. think yeah, that, I you think didn't care if I dress like them. <laughs> you didn't even care. I asked her. She got this from the thrift store. She said, "Don't You didn't care about the billiard." Oh, you look thrifty too. No, I asked her if she got no, this from the thrift store. She said, don't remember me. She rich in the camera. They go to play with thrifty closet, too. Like, That's not what I meant. Oh I meant like, my fashion is found in like the little nooks and crannies around the world and no one can ever <laughs> interpret that. <laughs> She's trying to be Iris Apple. Iris Apple will have more than just one. Y yeah, she would have like five of these on. At one time. Why is this that tech on Madison? It's probably not mine. Mm. Okay. Mom, daughter, at tip number one. Turn the light up in the bathroom. Tip number one. Mom, daughter, tip number one. I would say number one, communicate. Even if, even if it's the simplest of communication. Like, do you like this lipstick? Like, oh, yeah. Oh, two. Do something together. Now we are like we are like uh, we like fashion and makeup and stuff, so that's our thing. But if you guys like, and we also like uh, exercising too. Like we'll run together, um, we'll do exercise together. But if you guys are like, that's I exercise by myself now, and I have my tip on Monday. But anyway, but um, because but like that if is you're, cool. If you're artsy or whatnot, and you both like art or something. I'd say like we're foodies. Go somewhere. Um, maybe and try and like paint together or something. That sounds kind of like corny or whatnot, but it's, it'll be... I think people mostly can bond over the shopping bit and the makeup. But if you're not, well, I think every, well, no, not everyone likes makeup and stuff. Or just to go out. Yeah, just go do just something. Just go, go to Panera or, um, Dutch Bros or, um... Five guys, they have Starbucks good and have tea and coffee together, just like you would with a girlfriend. And you know, and that's just spend time together. So one would be communicate. And spend two time. would be spend time together. Three. Three. Oh, honesty. Be honest. And, with but one you, another. and I, I, what she said about the eighty twenty rule. You don't have to be as well, a like, parent. You're, you're only expecting but, eighty percent. And also, that's, you, you that's don't. The, that's the that's the bad. I mean. You don't have to give like eighty percent of what you really of the information you really want anyway. And then like you don't have to like if it's like something big or whatnot. You don't have to like. Pressurize them for the information. And you don't sit back and wait because eventually they'll share it with you. And, but also for the other side, you don't have to like give everything because of course there is in a relationship you also need privacy as well. But do share as much and be honest. Go on. I saw your lips in there. What did you say? Anyway, um, but just honesty also helps that relationship stay together because if you're not really telling the truth to the other person it makes them feel like i can't really trust you our relation our relationship isn't really grounded in anything and what you're telling me i have to take with a grain of salt and lastly be positive be positive and also um and you know 
uh, I think my channel is like about prayer and things like that. Also pray together, pray for each other, pray together. And when, you know, your young people are going through situations or whatnot, make sure they know that you are praying for them. Um, cause I guarantee you that they're praying for you as well. You know, teach them to trust and believe in God as well. And, and, and not just teach them that, but live that life, you know, show them, show them what is it? Uh, do as I say, and what's that quote where people say, do as I say, not do as I do. In this case, do exactly what you're teaching them to do. If you're telling them to read your read their Bible, you need to read your Bible. If you're telling them that they need to pray, you need to pray. Um, pray with them and for them. So I think, so one, it was communicate. Two, um, spend time together. Three was be open and honest. And four, positive be key. positive. And five would be pray together. Um, pray to, and together it's, it's and also, for each other. It's also really cool to have like a, a share relationship. Like if you guys are like reading the same um, chapter, it's also cool to have discussions about that, like in the Bible or whatnot, or you're having a similar devotional. You can bounce ideas off each other that way as well. Um, and yeah, do something together. Yeah. I think that goes back to doing something together, though. But yeah, it also it's like also kind of having a and, prayer partner as well. Yeah, but yeah, but you'd have to establish all those other things first. You know. <laughs> <laughs> but I do just I think, you know shoot everything down and <laughs> say okay. I'm just saying it's the same thing as spending time together, doing something together. So. Is part of that five thing already. Guys, hopeful, hopefully this was helpful to you all, which I really hope it was. If it was, please give us a thumbs up. Okay, and also the thumbs up, yeah, that's great. But also what I wanted to say was, it, it mother daughter relationships out there, what do you do? How do you relate together? What are some special things that you do as a mother to uplift and encourage your daughters or sons? Because it can apply to all. Um, uh, but I do believe like, I think mothers and sons have really close relationships and I think mothers and daughters do as well. In this case, I'm speaking from a mother daughter perspective. So what's something that you and you would, you do to encourage your daughter or daughters, what is it that you do to encourage your mom? And, um, I think I had a really, I have a really great mom and I wanted to incorporate a lot of what she taught me growing up with my own family and include things that I've learned over the years as well. So anyway, hopefully this was helpful. Add it in the comments below. How, you know, hopefully it was great. Yeah. Hopefully it was good. Nice anyway. jacket. <clears throat> so she does look cute. Oh no, she does oh. look cute. Anyway guys, thanks so much for watching. Bye. Oh, mine said why would she get dressed up to